Now let's take a look at some of this week's highlights in the business world. The European Union says it may impose anti-dumping duties on imports of shoes from China and Vietnam starting in April. The tax rate will begin at 4% and is expected to grow to 20% by this autumn. EU officials say they have no plans to introduce quotas on shoe imports. This is the EU's largest anti-dumping case against China. So far, the Ministry of Commerce has received no official confirmation of the tax from the EU, which will make the final decision as early as next month. The sixth China-EU Energy Conference in Shanghai saw China and the European Union agree to further cooperation in combating greenhouse gases. They reached a memorandum of understanding on issues including energy security, efficiency, and renewable sources. The move will bring the two parties together in the research of zero emission technology. Such technology reduces pollution by trapping and storing carbon emissions from fuel smoke. The first target for the technology is the clean use of coal. China burns coal for more than 60% of its power generation. China may allow insurers to start fund management firms and invest in financial derivatives to create more high-return investment instruments. The China Insurance Regulatory Commission says the country will speed up the trial process. The plan accompanies a draft ruling allowing qualified insurance firms to buy controlling stakes in fund managing and other financial institutions. Allowing insurance fund management would enable insurers to manage third-party funds. It would also further loosen China's grip on financial institutions and enable them to invest outside their business. Mr. Zhu for Bizwa.